Hi everybody, AccuSquirrel2000 here bringing you another pest control video. This video does contain some graphic content, so viewer discretion is advised. Some viewers may find this type of content to be disturbing. If you are one such viewer, please leave now. These videos are not intended to glorify the killing of animals, but are being provided as an educational resource for pest control. So today I'm going to be operating the Benjamin Armada 25 caliber PCP air rifle. This is a wonderful gun for a small game. And I'm going to be shooting ammunition by Rat Sniper Slugs. This is the 32 grain Spitzer hollow point. And here's the squirrel today. Now this squirrel in particular gave me a bit of a unique uh, sight picture. Uh, he goes right behind this tree and um, is just barely visible. So I waited him out just a little bit. And in a second he's going to turn back around and he gives me an oblique sight picture um, that allows me to land a combination shot that is both a vital shot and a head shot. Um, this behavior is known as neurologic disinhibition, I'll come back to that in just a second. But here's the shot again. Now if you look at the sight picture and the alignment of the rifle, you can see that uh, I'm aiming directly at the eye socket and that's going to go right straight through the neck. Uh, down into the thoracic cavity where the heart and lungs are and out the opposite shoulder and if you watch uh, you can see that the shot was uh, straight on um, and it was an instant kill the disinhibition I'll explain in a second now take a look at the slow motion you can see that uh, some rotational inertia was created from the shot that's because the squirrel has most of its weight on the back legs um, and as such uh, the forward position strike of the, of the slug uh, makes the squirrel rotate like that. So coming up we've got the post shot analysis. This is some more graphic content where I'll be analyzing the squirrel. So heads up on that. Uh, I want to talk about the post shot behavior known as neurologic disinhibition. This is very much a dead squirrel. You can tell because the head acts literally as dead weight, almost like an anchor. Uh, and you can see that there's these uncontrolled spasms. And this is a very common, very normal behavior of a dead animal. The fact that it's moving doesn't mean it's alive. This means that the brain has gone offline. And long story short, in most all mammals, muscles are uh, very chaotic and are kept calm with a calming signal from the brain. You remove that calming signal, this is what you see. So neurologic disinhibition is a very clear sign that an animal is in fact dead. Now uh, here's the squirrel. As you can see there's the exit on the shoulder. Uh, so you can see this is a very uh, clean shot through and through from the head to the shoulder. So I did hit the thoracic cavity as intended. And you can see the point of impact was right at the eye. So again, uh, it struck exactly where I wanted it to go. Uh, it took the path, exactly the path that I wanted it to take and resulted in the kill that I wanted, which was an instant kill. So um, this was a very good, very clean shot. Um, and I look forward to making more shots like this. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment, or share, and we'll see you on the next video.